GH Dog TV, your number one TV for all dog lovers. This is Eddie K of Eddie K's Kennel GH. Keep watching GH Dog TV. Dogs, dogs, dogs. That's what we do on our channel all day, every day. In case you're new on our channel, this is GH Dog TV, your number one dog TV for all dog lovers. And my name is Solo One. You can call me the dog blogger. If you're new on our channel, I kindly urge you to subscribe to our channel and then you hit on the notification bell icon for more exclusive and amazing dog content. Now, on today's episode, we are visiting a Rottweiler kennel, and I'm sure you're loving the dogs right here so we're going to speak to the bosses behind this beautiful kennel and check out some of the beautiful dogs at this kennel so don't go anywhere stick and stay as we check out this episode on gh dog tv don't go anywhere okay welcome back from that quick break now today's location is kaswa of fanko in the central region of ghana and the name of this kennel is crowded empire kennel very beautiful kennel filled with top quality rottweilers and i'm sure you're already loving the scenes right here but then before i get up close with my bosses here let me acknowledge our proud sponsor Josira dog food Josira dog food dog food with passion i know you're, you're wondering you, you've got dogs and you start to wonder which food should i feed my dogs with which foods should i feed my dog with now just pick the contact details on our screen and go get any product from Josira dog food Josira dog food they have different different types for every dog every breed each stage of life every nutritional need every nutritional need for your dogs Josira has got you covered so just pick their contact details on our screen pick their contact details go to any pet shop get any product from Josira dog food and trust me your dogs are going to get all of the nutrients they need and it's going to keep them very healthy now i'm right here with this wonderful team here and just as i told you the current location is crowded empire kettle so allow me to introduce my guest for today's show let me start from you madam welcome to the show thank you Get to this boss man as well. Boss man, welcome to the show as well. Thank you, Chema. Yeah, let me start from you. I'd like you to introduce yourself to, to my dog lovers who are watching us. Let me tell the ladies first of all. <laughs> so you want me to start with the ladies? Start with the ladies, yes, please. <laughs> okay, then let me get to the lady. I'd like you to officially introduce yourself you. to my dog lovers. My name is Yacherewa, and I am the secretary for Crowded Empire Kennel. And so basically we manage the kennel together and um, concern everything regarding the animals you have to go through us yeah coming here i'm really loving the dogs right here the kennel setup and everything yeah we've worked hard and then it's the work is speaking for itself fantastic, fantastic. i love it when i get to meet ladies who are more involved in this dog breeding business and all of that. Now, boss man, it's, it's your turn to introduce yourself. <laughs> My name is Kofi Safu. Yeah, I'm the manager of Crowded Empire Kennel. Okay, okay, okay. So just as she said, you you manage the kennels together. Yes, please. Yeah. Nice one, nice one, nice one. Now, be, be, before we, we talk about other things and then we check out the dogs and the beautiful kennels and all of the things you have here, I'd like to um, start with you. Um, how long has Crowded Empire Kennel been running? Okay, we have been in existence for, let's say, Less than two years. Yeah, less than two years. Let's say a year and a half. Wow, a year and a half. Less than two years and there are these beautiful... Wow, I love it. I'm, I'm really, really impressed. Thank you. Nice one. Now, let me get to this beautiful lady right here. Now, um, let me ask, why the name Crowded Empire Kennel? Why the name Crowded Empire Kennel? Okay, so Crowded Empire Kennel because 
um, we envisage the kennel to go bigger than this. And then in the near future, we expect that it will be crowded with different kinds of um, breeds. And yeah, basically that's it. We gave we, we chose Crowded Empire because we expect or we envisage the kennel to go into a bigger one. It's crowded with top quality dogs here and there. Yes. Crowded pedigree dogs. This is beautiful. And right now we have the Rottweilers right here. So now let, let's get with how your love for dogs began. Because I know that with this kind of work and everything, if... You, you do not love dogs, you cannot do it. So how, how did your love for dogs start? Um, growing up, my dad had 15 dogs at home. Wow. Yes. They were not foreign dogs or um, pedigree dogs. They were normal dogs. And so I grew up loving dogs because growing up with dogs, you definitely love them. You would play with them. Dogs were our friends. I, I wasn't going out. I didn't have friends. I still don't have friends. Dogs are my friends. <laughs> really? Yes. So will you, will you um, there's this popular saying where people say they can they can trust dogs more than humans. Do you? Yeah. I would say that too. So at which age specifically can you remember you being introduced to dogs? Anymore? At age three. At a, I remember at age three, my dad had five dogs. So he, because he didn't want us to go out, he made the dogs are friends and so we come back from school we do our homeworks and then you play you just go to the compound and play with the dogs go and play go and play you, it's dogs there so you play with dogs yes got to a point where you had 15 dogs my dad loved dogs so I remember some of the breeds or um i wouldn't i didn't know the names of the dogs at the time so I don't think I would be able, but there were mixed breeds here and there. I remember we had um, these hairy dogs, I've forgotten the name. And then some few local dogs here and there. And I remember we had one German Shepherd. Yes. I can really understand your obsession with dogs. <laughs> yeah. We'll get to the part where we talk about your first dogs and all, but then let me get to the boss man here. So, boss man, how did your love for dogs also start? Actually, I had my first dog when I was around 22 years. Yeah, 22 years. Yeah, because at first I was afraid of dogs. Yeah, because I was bitten once. My childhood, yeah. So, <laughs> but at the age of 22, I was like, okay, let me get myself a dog. So I got a puddle. Yeah, and then I named it after me. Yeah, that's 2018. That's my birthday, second August. Yeah, and then it was kind of fun. That was when I started to love dogs. It was fun. Yeah, we worked together. In fact, we did everything together. And then so one day my girlfriend came by and said, "Okay, Nana, I just love your dog." I said, "Okay, take it away because <laughs> <laughs> dog lovers. I'm loving the story right here. That's the power of a woman right there." <laughs> so she came and she said she loved the dog. Yeah, and then I was like, "Oh, okay, Abby, she loves me." And then I named the dog after me, 20. So I was like, okay, whenever you, you see the dog, you see me. So you just take it away. So you and then give the dog away? Oh, that day, like I cried, but I still have to let it go. <laughs> <laughs> dog lovers, I've, I've heard dog stories, stories about dogs and dogs, but this one, <laughs> it over me. <laughs> and then you talked about you being bitten by a dog. Can you narrate how it, it happened? It was a terrible situation that day, and I just don't want to remember it. <laughs> I just want to remember it. <laughs> I'm sure it really took you a while before oh, you could yeah. get. Yeah, since then I was afraid of dogs. Even when your dog is like even three kilometers away from me, I'll be like, hey, go back, go back, go back, go back. Huh? And then I was like, oh, nah. My mom, how can I So at the age of 20, 21, then I was like, okay, let me get myself a dog. And then I purchased one. That was the paddle. And then it was just a puppy. And then I trained it uh, until it, become, it became mature. And I was like, okay, wow. At first, I have a perspective that dogs were no good since I was bitten. But now I was like, okay, dogs were good. Dogs are, God made dogs for man. That's what I would say. Yeah. Now, um, so, now you talking about you bitten by a dog. I've met with another breeder. Big shout outs to Mr. Otu of Bully House Kennel. He also said he was also bitten by a dog and 
I have been bitten by a dog three times. I think I remember I mentioned in the episode. There are people who have been bitten by dogs, but they are still afraid. But I see you here with these big road wireless and you are vibing with them. Even before we proceed with the interview, I'd like you to tell something to search people. Somebody who has been bitten by dogs and they can't get over it. Whenever they see dogs, they like, go away and those can they, they still fear. What message can you give to them? Okay, I just w- want to tell them, um, just get yourself one dog. Yeah. Uh, cater for the dog, do everything for the dog, and I bet you, you love the dog more than you love yourself. Yes, 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 for sure, for sure. You have a girlfriend too, she can eventually <laughs> convince you to get the dog. <laughs> nice one, dog lovers. I'm, I'm, I'm loving the conversation right here with this team right here. Yes, they are the, the, the team behind the solid brand, Crowded Empire Kennel. Top quality rod wireless. I'm sure you're loving the scenes right here with this beautiful roti here. Check him out. Woo! Nice one. So now um let, let, let me let me ask this question. So I've come to this kennel and I've seen that the, the kennel is branded with a beautiful rod wireless and they are rod wireless here as well. So why rod wireless? I know there are lots of dog beats, so why why rod wireless? And um, rod wireless because they are very unique and they are outstanding looking at other breeds there are different colors and variety of um, shades of dogs but looking at rods when you see a rod you see a rod um, because of their the black and the tan when you see a rod you'll be able to identify that this is a rod and then they are be very beautiful and protective of their owners as well so that's why a rod Yes, indeed, it's true. You can see that with lots of the breeds, they come in different colors and all of that. But when you see a Rottweiler, they have this one unique color. Check out this beautiful Rotti here. Wow. Just two colors. Yes, that's the color for the Rottweiler right here. So that's actually why you're doing what. But do you, do you see yourself doing other breeds in the near future? Most definitely. We'll, just as the name said, Crowded Empire and... We are envisaging to open up the kennel, so definitely you'll see other breeds of dogs. In the future, but now it's just rot wireless for now. Yeah. Nice one, nice one, nice one, Bossman. Now let me let me get to you, Bossman. Dog lovers, very soon we'll get to my favorite part where we check out some of the dogs at this kennel. But I'm sure you're already loving the dogs right here. And this beautiful one right here too as well. Now, Bossman, um, how many dogs do you have currently at Crowded Empire Kennel? You know, how many were wireless? Right now we have nine rods. Yeah, three solid meals. Yeah, and then six females. Yeah. yeah. Three solid meals and six females. Six females, yeah. Um, Start services, you do crossing for people and all of that. Yeah, sure. We, we do store them, then everything. Yeah. Before we get to see some of these dogs, can you mention some of the meals? Yeah, let's start with the meal, some of the memes and all of that. Okay, right now we have um, Snyder. That's the strong, in fact, the strongest meal we have right now. Yeah. And then we have um, Gadu. Yeah, we call him Nixon. Nixon, he's also a strong meal. And then we have the other one too, Champion. Yeah. Nice one, nice one, nice one. This is, this is beautiful dog lovers. I'm sure you just can't wait to check out the dogs and all of that. Okay, so. I've seen the kennel right here, very spacious with the dogs. I love the branding. Welcome to Crowded Empire Kennel and all of that. But I also see other houses or should I say facilities? Yes. Also, Asai, can you can you tell us something about these rooms and all of that? Yes. Yeah, so we have the whooping room. And um, that's where when the dogs deliver, we take them to and take care of their mothers and the puppies as well. And then we have the maternity room. That's where the dogs actually deliver. That's where we help the dogs to deliver. And we're actually sitting in the kitchen. You can see our deep freezer behind us. That's where we store our meat and dog food and anything concerning the dogs. That has to be stored in the freezer. Yes. That, that, that will draw me, since you're talking about the kitchen, can I, can I, that, that draws me to the next question. Um, so how do you, do you feed the dogs with only cables or? Oh, you feed them with them. Um, you mentioned meat and all of that. So, what, what do you feed the dogs with? Um, minced meat, chicken back, rice, and anything good for the dog. Nice, nice, nice. 
vegetables and all of that. Nice one, dog lovers. Now, as she's talking about, we are talking about dog food and kibbles. Let me acknowledge our proud sponsors, Josira Dog Food. Josira Dog Food. Trust me, if you're looking for a nutritious dog food, food for your dogs dog feed for your dogs just pick their contact details on your on our screen they have dog food for every dog at every stage at every stage puppy adults they have sauces with flavors beef chicken game trust me you're going to you're going to love them they have puppy milk too so just pick their contact details on our screen and get any product from Josira pet food Josira dog food, the dog food with a passion. Now, dog lovers, we are approaching my favorite part where we check out the names of some of the dogs here and all of that. But then before I go, let me let me talk to this postman about some of the challenges so far that you faced since you started breeding these dogs and all of that. I know the, cha- the main challenge you're facing is their feed. Yeah, their feed is becoming too much, especially the pellets and other stuff is becoming like it's too expensive but yes we have to buy it because we are just breeding the dogs yeah, so we just have to buy it whether it go up goes up goes up still we have to buy it and apart from that maybe the meats and then other stuff yeah. apart from that yeah, we are good to go we're talking about um, we were talking about the challenges it's about the, the general shooting of the prices we know things have really shorter in Ghana yeah, yeah. things are really going in Ghana Everything is expensive now in Ghana. Very, very true. Now, Bosman, before we, we, we leave and then you say um, your final message and all of that, I'd like you to drop out your contact details. I know somebody is watching and they would like to link up with Crowded Empire Kennel. They would love to get some of the dogs for crossing. They want to link up for puppies and all of that, seeing the kennel and the beautiful dogs. So I'd like you to drop out the contact details, social media and everything. And I think um, you also have a pet shop, right? Yes, I'd like you to hit on that too. Yeah, okay. Right now, um, we are, I'm owning a pet shop. Let's say we, not um, We are owning a pet shop. From Enkad Pet Shop. Look at that, Kaswa New Market. Yeah, we sell all kinds of dog feeds, supplements, vitamins, like anything that will boost up your dog. Just come to Framen Card Pet Shop, Kaswa. Yeah. And then apart from that, our social media, we are, all, we are on all social media. Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, YouTube. We're just searching Crowded Empire Kennel. Sorry. The Crowded is C-R-O-W-D-E-D. And then Empire Kennel. Just search it. Just search. you find it there. And then our contact number is 0240-559926. Let me go again. 0240-559926 and then 027-444-027-444-3643. Just give us a call. Wherever you are, we will attend to you. Nice one, nice one, nice one, dog lovers. He just dropped out the contact details. He just dropped out the contact details and it's boldly written on our screens. Link up with them for start services. Puppies. They also want a pet shop. Link up with them. And then one, uh, we do dog importation too. Yeah, we import dogs. So if you have uh, any breed of dog that you want to import, you just link, link up. Everything will be done. Nice one, nice one, nice one. Dog lovers. Today the current location is Kaswa of Fanko in the central region of Ghana. And it's not far from the greater Accra region of Ghana. Some people even say it's part of the greater aqua region of ghana because the distance is not too far now bossman before we get to the introduction i'd like you to say your final words to my dog lovers just anything could be to upcoming breeders advice to upcoming breeders dog anything okay what i will tell my upcoming breeders and then dog lovers is that um you just have to get time for your dog yeah it's a matter of time and dedication just dedicate yourself to whatever you are doing. You say you want to be those, dedicate your time to your dose. And trust me, wherever you want to go, you'll read it. Nice one, nice one, nice one. And I can't just let us leave without getting a final message from this beautiful lady right here too. I'd like you to say your final message to my dog, Lois. Um, just as my colleague said, um, dedication, care and love for your dogs and you get good results. 
for Dog Lovers. Dog Lovers, just as I mentioned today, we are at Crowded Empire Kennel. And this is the part where we get to check out some of the dogs at this kennel. My name is Solo One, you can call me the dog blogger. We get to my favorite part, we check out the dogs. But then, if this is your first time of watching a video on this channel, kindly urge you to kindly subscribe to our channel and then you hit on the notification bell icon for more exclusive and amazing dog content. And then you also follow us on all of our social media handles on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at GHDogBlogger. Don't go anywhere, we get to my favorite part. We check out some of the dogs at Crowded Empire Kennel. Okay, so we are my favorite part where we check out some of the dogs at Crowded Empire Kennel. And then we start with this beautiful female here. So I'd love you to introduce this dog to my dog lovers. Okay, so this is Daisy and she's the youngest female in our kennel as of now. Um, I love Daisy for two reasons. She's beautiful and she's very protective. Yes. Even as I came here, I've seen some action from her back in and all of that. Yeah. Was she imported or she's a born and bred in Ghana? She she was imported from Serbia. Yes. Nice one. And how do how old is she? Um she's one year, two months. <laughs> nice one, dog lover. So this is the first dog we are introducing at Crowded Empire Kennel. Very beautiful dog right here, dog lovers. Just just check her out. Check her out. Just check this beautiful girl out. Wow. Right here at Crowded Empire Kennel. Beautiful. Okay, dog lovers, and we have the second dog we are introducing from Crowded Empire Kennel here too. Wow, such a beauty. Yeah, so this is Jessie. Um, she is also a female. And as you can see, she's heavily pregnant. And she's the f one of the dogs. We have four females who are pregnant at the moment, including her five. So, yes, she's the she's a female, and I love her too. For mm, she's also aggressive. Some would say she's aggressive, but I would say she's protective, and she's sweet with all the licking. Because <laughs> <laughs> I can tell her how sweet she is, dog lovers. Check out this beautiful dog right here. Very beautiful, and just as she mentioned, if you want to link up with Crowded Empire Kennel. The contact details are on our screen and their location is Kaswa of Fanko Court Junction in Ghana. So just pick up their contact details and link up with them dog lovers. Now let's check out this beauty right here at Crowded Empire Kennel. Okay, dog lovers, so we move to the next dog. We have this big boy right here. <laughs> yeah, this is Snyder. And that's our strong guest, or one of our strong male dogs here in Crowded Empire. Uh, yeah. Snyder is also sweet. And I think I'll say all the dogs here are protective. <laughs> and Snyder is available for start service, right? Yes, please. How old is he? He's three. Dog lovers, check out Snyder right here. Very beautiful dog right here at Crowded Empire Kennel. Wow. Snyder. Just check him out. I love the pose right there. Wow. And we have this beautiful male right here. Can you tell us something about this beautiful male here? Um, his name is Gado. Um, he's the youngest male in our kennel as of now. Yes. And I love this dog because it's playful, very playful. He, like, he likes to give me hugs, so I love it. <laughs> nice one. I think I've seen this dog giving you lots of hugs right here. Yeah. It's not in the mood to give me a hug. He would have given me a hug. He goes, yes, he was just about to give the hug. <laughs> nice one. And he's available for start service, right? Yes, please, he is. So this is the last dog we are introducing right here at Crowded Empire Kennel. So in case you want to link up with Crowded Empire Kennel, pick up their contact details on our screen for stood services, puppies, 
top quality rod wireless right here at this kennel and then if you're new on our channel i kindly urge you to kindly subscribe to our channel and then you hit on the notification bell icon for more exclusive and amazing dog content this episode was proudly sponsored by Josira dog food you want dog food for your dogs very nutritious that will keep them healthy trust me link up with Josira dog food their contact details are on our screen pick it up give them a call they have puppy milk they have sauces they have dog food for every breed whatever breed you have nutritional need come on trust me just go to any pet shop and get any product from Josira dog food so this is what we have for you today on gh dog tv my name is solo one you can call me the dog blogger catch you another time gh dog tv your number one tv for all dog lovers